Hey everybody, death in the air here. Guess what I'm holding in my hand? Nope, not that. A fucking record. I just want to make a quick little uh, video here. I have absolutely fallen in love with Final. I've been wanting to get a record player for fucking ever, and I finally have one, and I've already, my collection's already getting fucking big. I got about eight or nine records already. This is going to be a quick, short, short little video telling you all out there to support, if you have any, support your local fucking record stores. You have a turntable, a phonograph. All that good shit. Support your fucking local record stores in this digital age. And I pause and all that. Don't get me wrong, I have one. I use it. But I only really use it when I go out. So, in this fucking day and age, vinyl and cassettes are so important and have really made a huge comeback. To me, I mean, how fucking cool is this? The artwork stands out more. The fucking uh, get full both the records come in. This one's out, but um, it's just so fucking uh, the little fucking thing. The record comes in and the uh, big ass fucking picture of the band you get right no lyrics on the back fucking love that so much so just going to say that vinyl is the fucking uh shit it is awesome and back when back before we got fucking overtook him with this digital shit for those of you who don't know I'm sure you do those of you who watch my channel watch my content um I'm sure are uh, aware of records and such and uh, yeah how fucking awesome they are and uh just look how fucking cool that is. The artwork just jumps right out at you. So, uh, support your local fucking record stores. If you can find first pressing, that's that's even better. I got a few first pressings of Judas Priest, Defenders of the Faith, and Screaming for Vengeance. And a first pressing of uh, Master of Reality. By fucking Black Sabbath on record store today. Uh, Tiggers and Daggers and the Strawberry Alarm Clock are my two. And Barnes and Noble, sometimes they carry vinyl. Any way you can, wherever the fuck it is you live, support your fucking local record store. It's it's a it's a time honored thing that never gets old. I went in there yesterday and I found fucking a band from a new wave of British heavy metal band, a new wave of British heavy metal band called fucking Raven, wiped out. I kind of knew about them, but I never thought in a million years I'd be able to buy one of the records, and I did. It's fucking awesome. Uh, can't stress enough how cool and how fucking uh, awesome it is to just build a in this day and age where CDs and all that shit seems to be going away will it never go away how fucking cool and badass this is it's just so awesome so uh, <clears throat> support your local record stores buy records and uh fucking uh don't fucking buy my knee band shit unless it's something very rare but there's nothing like going in there 
flipping through the bins and all that and going through and looking and finding something. It's just so fucking cool, especially in the new arrivals that uh and Tiggers and Daggers I found fucking uh Dio the last in line. So so much cool shit I found in there. Um but anyways Yes, I 100% support this. Uh, it's gonna be kind of my investment now, my thing. I'm gonna buy records and make a fucking big ass collection. Uh, if you don't have a fun or graph player or whatever, get one and make this a uh, thing. You won't fucking regret it. It's awesome. Uh, it's simple. It's effective, and my collection's only gonna get bigger. So that's all I got. Support your fucking local record store. Buy records. Death in the year. Oh, and ride the lightning is coming very soon for what Metallica means to me. Right. I'm out.